adding degrading of newly registered drugs to the guidelines will affect clinical practice because it will be easier for doctors and patients to make decisions uh, and see how the drug is positioned versus other drugs. The ESMO clinical practice guidelines are evidence-based statements, peer-reviewed, multidisciplinary, and uh, they intend to assist the practitioner towards best clinical practice. The guideline committee grades the drugs according to the ESMO magnitude of clinical benefit scale tool, and the working group on the ESMO magnitude of clinical benefit scale checks the grading. The reason to incorporate it now in the new guidelines and to make it part of e-updates is that there are exciting new drugs um, registered in Europe and this is a tool to assist clinicians and patients to make decisions to use the drug or not. <laughs> The idea behind this scale is that's developed to get information on the clinical benefit, not on the cost, but on the clinical benefit. And aspects taken into account for clinical benefit are issues like overall survival, progression-free survival, but also quality of life, side effects, reduction of side effects. We are all being told about statistical significance, but uh, both oncologists and patients are not being told about the magnitude of the clinical benefit, the clinical significance of a, a new therapeutic strategy in any standardized way. So the MCBS score is a standardized, robust, validated tool that the physician may apply to a new drug indication and he's going to be able to rank the clinical benefit in five scales, one to five and discuss this information with the patient. This evolution of the scale, this moving document is critical because there's so many developments in oncology and we have to capture this. We have to stay up to date. Using the scale to grade newly registered drugs and um, make that part of the guidelines and of the e-updates really translates uh, the tool towards clinical practice and make it easy usable by oncologists and patients in their everyday practice.